AMC stock is about to make people rich. But before I do get into why I believe this, make sure to go down and subscribe if you are new to the channel because I do update you guys on AMC stock every single day. So today we closed up yet another 8%. We closed at exactly $3.42, 420. Let's freaking go. AMC is now up nearly 40% in the past five days. Something big is brewing up with AMC stock. The short interest has been insane. We've been saying on my channel the past couple of videos that there's three things, three factors that cause a short squeeze and you need to check off all three things before you can confirm that a short squeeze is most likely going to happen. Obviously, this isn't guaranteed. This isn't financial advice whatsoever. Me personally, I have my life savings invested into AMC, so I will be holding until the MOAS happens and it's feeling mighty squeezy right now. So those three main things that caused a short squeeze is short interest, good news, and a jump up in share price that scares everyone that's shorting the stock out of the stock, which causes even more momentum. So we got all three of those things down. In the beginning when we were going down, we just had the good news and the short interest. We were at $3 and we crashed down to $2.38, which was our bottom. At that point in time, right here about five, six days ago, we only had a bunch of short interests and a bunch of good news, but the stock was doing terribly. And I was telling you guys, we need this jump up in share price, a jump up that's going to scare these shorties and look what we got these past five days we got exactly what we were hoping for so we're up 40 percent shorties are crapping their pants a lot of them are looking to close their short position especially if amc goes higher from here the momentum is just building 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 and the squeeze could happen in a span of 30 minutes the squeeze could happen in a span of an hour like it could happen within one day that's what people don't understand and once it happens it's going to be too late for day traders to hop in they might freeze the buy button like they did back in 2020 have you guys ever heard this saying history repeats itself it makes sense for this to happen again look at dogecoin look at bitcoin look at shiba look at all these cryptos they pumped like gamestop and amc back in 2020 and 2021 they pumped in 2024 and it looks like the meme stocks are going to be a little delayed but they're also going to pump in 2024 this is just my personal opinion not financial advice whatsoever i'm not telling anyone to buy hold or sell you guys do whatever you want with your money but me personally i'm looking at buying more screw it i might buy more right now at three dollars and 42 cents after hours we're trading at three dollars and 43 cents we hit a high of three dollars and 40 nine cents in the morning we did go down to three dollars flat you know they tried their best to short us for almost like two three weeks straight we were trading like up a penny down two pennies for like a whole two three weeks just today we moved 49 cents from three dollars to three dollars and 49 cents our low to our high that's 49 cents which is a lot more compared to moving a couple pennies a day the momentum is building people are starting to watch amc something huge is about to happen i i'm holding i'm freaking holding no matter what i'm in for the squeeze because if we zoom out guys it might look like we're up but in reality we're down we are still down about 99% from our all-time high. We are still trading at levels that AMC has never traded at in the past decade. AMC has never been this low in history. Still, even though we're up 40% in the past five days, we're still trading at all-time lows, which is why I'm still looking at buying more because the price of AMC is not correct right now. I think it's an artificial price. I don't think it's real. And I think the price is going to be adjusted very, very soon. So this guy said AMC had a 20 plus minutes downtrend right at the beginning of the trading session, almost 4 million in volume, most of it down. If you think that retail investors sold at $3, you should see a psychiatrist ASAP. AMC is the biggest crime scene in economic history. People are gonna go to jail. People are gonna get freaking locked up. Ken Griffin's gonna burn in the deepest depths of hell. But AMC, from $2.38, we now close at $3.42 in the span of five days. That is a major jump. Obviously, it's not the MOAS that we're looking for, but it is something to look at. I was reading an article that said AMC jumps up with no clear signs of why it jumped up. Well, that's what they weren't saying when AMC was going down. They were saying, oh, AMC is going down because it's going bankrupt, bankruptcy, boom, boom, boom. But now that it's going up, there's no clear signs as to why it's going up. When all of us apes know the real reason to why it's going up, because it's doomsday. Doomsday is freaking coming. Launch day is coming and it's coming fast this guy said amc nine month breakout this is a possible breakout of a nine month wedge pattern just broke and retested today not financial advice but you cannot say you wish you knew about this earlier that is facts i mean if people knew that amc was going to be a steal at two dollars and fifty cents they would have bought in 
but these day traders are scared of AMC. I feel like a lot of people are scared of AMC. Who wouldn't be? Some people are still down 99% after this 40% jump. So obviously, people are going to be scared. You know, I respect that. But like I said, you got to have balls for plays like this. You got to have a high risk tolerance because this is one of the most riskiest plays in the freaking stock market. I'm not going to lie. But I'm a risk taker, me, myself. That's why this is not financial advice. I'm just letting you know that I'm balls deep in AMC. I'm all in. This guy said something is brewing at AMC stock once again like in 2020. This is not advice. I am just an ordinary person looking at charts and historical graphs. All I can say is something is brewing at AMC. This is not a joke. Something huge is coming once again. History may repeat once again just like in 2020. Volumes have been picking up lately by some specific hedge fund. The squeeze is any time from now on. It will be fast and quick. It is coming soon. Peace. The real apes are here. Yeah, like he said, it is coming fast and it is coming soon. You know, if you just take a look at the graphs, look at all the cryptos. They already pumped. One of my friends literally bought Shiba the other day. I was trying to convince him when AMC was trading below $3. I was like, AMC is a steal. Don't freaking listen to me. Go buy your crypto, but I'm letting you know. Just watch my channel. AMC is a freaking steal. But he didn't listen. You know, he bought Shiba. Now he's down. And he could have been up right now. He could have been up if he would have bought AMC under $3. But, you know, that's his money. I don't really care. I care about my money. And I am all in. I am all in for this freaking squeeze. This guy said, Apes know that HYMC is a great hedge against financial collapse. Gold will go higher if you know you know. Hashtag AMC. So China is dumping US treasuries and buying gold. We all know that AMC is invested into HYMC. HYMC is a stock that mines gold, silver, all that stuff. And we own guaranteed 22%, probably more. Adam Aaron did say he was looking at doubling his position and ownership into HYMC. AMC owns owns a lot of HYMC. So with HYMC going up, the financials for AMC are going up as well. I mean, they're talking hundreds of millions of dollars here. Gold is just a no brainer, obviously. So I'm pretty sure everyone saw this article that's watching my video. So the article says AMC stock continues rally as movie theater chain updates credit strategy. So shares of AMC entertainment holdings were up 4.8% as the company's stock rally continues. It was actually up over 10% from its peak of $3.49. It goes on to say in an SEC filing after market close on Friday, AMC announced that it is not renewing a 225 million senior secured revolving credit facility. AMC has paid off any remaining obligations related to the credit facility, which is set to expire Monday, the company said. So this is huge for AMC. I mean, this is just insanely good news. You know, AMC is paying off its debt. AMC has an insane movie slate for the next three years. If you take a look at AMC's financials, everything is green. Everything is green except the stock. You can't find really any negative news on AMC. And if you could find it, you know, at me, go ahead and show me what you find. I've been trying to find it myself. The only thing that's negative about AMC is its stock. Obviously, the debt is bad too. Obviously, that's one of the most obvious reasons. But AMC doesn't have to pay off the debt right now. AMC has cash on hand. Bankruptcy is not even in the picture right now. So the debt's going to be paid off. That's all I got to say. So I'm buying more AMC. You know, I don't see AMC going bankrupt in my lifetime, at least. That's why I will continue to hold. This guy posted this meme, me sell AMC, that's impossible. And just that little freaking kid, that's a little AMC ape. It's not happening, hashtag AMC, I need to buy more. Honestly, I need to chill. Like, I want to stop myself from buying AMC. It's an addiction, especially when I know it's at a steal, you know, but it's also good to save a little bit of money on the side. You know, I already have 90, more than 90% of all my life savings into AMC. I still gotta have some cash, obviously, on hand, but I mean, I have everything in AMC. And it's hard for me not to put the last bit of money that I have into AMC, because I know it's coming. I know it's gonna be life changing when the squeeze does happen, and I am holding for it. I will continue to hold for it. This guy said, good morning from Germany. Have a great week ahead. This is actually me. This meme made me laugh out loud. Smoke alarm asleep. Tornado asleep. Home invasion asleep. AMC pre-market. That's literally me at 3 in the morning waking up to see AMC just jump up in the pre-market. And then I go back to sleep, obviously, and wake up for work. But we're not going to have to be going to work once the MOAS happens. I'm ready to just call my boss and tell him, hey, yo, remember that stock I was talking about? That's right, I quit, I'm out.
Boom, Moas. Let's freaking do this. But that's gonna do it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Once again, make sure to go down and subscribe if you are new to the channel because I do update you guys on AMC stock every single day. Only about 25% of the people watching my videos are actually subscribed. What the heck are you guys doing? If you watch to the end, make sure to go down and subscribe. We are on our way to 2,000 apes, 2,000 AMC investors. And I know we could get there before the squeeze actually happens. When the squeeze actually happens, a lot of people are gonna be coming to the channel. A lot of people are gonna be seeing the videos that were made in my humble opinion not financial advice this is inevitable you could be negative about it all you want but at the end of the day the glass is always half full and you got to look at it from the positive way you know you haven't lost if you haven't sold you could be down 50 percent. you could be down 70 percent. but if you hold i do believe in the long term you will be up you just got to look at some of the most famous quotes about the stock market it's all about patience the stock market wants you to sell at a loss but are you going to do it or are you gonna be patient? That's all it is. I believe we're gonna keep going up tomorrow, the next day, this momentum is gonna keep building, but that is just my personal opinion, and I guess we'll just have to wait and find out. But I'll catch you guys in my next video. As y'all know, I'm buying the dip. Here we go, come on, push it.